Hello everyone. So I'm coming back with the second part of the second chapter of kinematics. That means I'm going to discuss about the second part of the chapter uniformly accelerated motion. Okay. So in this discussion, I'm going to derive the formula for uniformly accelerated motion. Okay. Maybe during the class nine you all have came across the formula of uniformly accelerated motion. Okay. So the formula ke ta moi akko ebar repeat korbo bisari so. The first formula is V is equal to U plus A T, and it is known as velocity time relation. Okay. Where V represents final velocity, U represents initial velocity, A represents acceleration during the motion. And T represents time taken to cover that whole motion. Now the second formula is known as position time relation, and it is represented as S is equal to U T plus half of A T square, where S is the distance covered by the moving object, U initial velocity, A acceleration, T time, and third one is position velocity relation, and the mathematical expression. Of the position velocity relation is v square minus u square is equal to twice a s. Okay. Now there are two methods in order to derive these three formulas, and those two methods are known as general method and graphical method. So here I am going to use the first method. That means the general method. In order to derive these three formula, and then in our previous videos, I'm going to discuss about the graphical methods to derive these three formulas. So, at first, my general method use kori a tinta equation or expression ba formula derive kori, and then our upcoming videos bilakot my next. Graphical method use kori, eight in the video ki kori derive kori. Ajay exam or tumar lokor jodi hai kono method or kotha mention kori nidi hai. Tadiya tumar lokor nijo or soi soi motte zikuno eta method use kori a formula kita ki kori bhi sara para derive kori bhi para. But jodi question paper or specify kori diye that you have to use the general method in order to derive. The formula, these three formula of uniformly accelerated motion. Then general method use kori bolle kita. And jodi question paper or graphical method use kori formula kita derive kori bolle kot. That is graphical method use kori bolle kito. Now I am going to use the first method, that means general method, in order to derive these three formula. And then next I will use graphical method in order to derive the same three formula of uniformly 